Hey, so what's going on guys? Make here with Driven Tech Reviews and welcome back to another video. Today we have another product from Omelette. This is the Pro Plus Dock Charger. So if you have more than two controllers, you'll definitely appreciate having an accessory like this for your Nintendo Switch. So let's get into the packaging real quick. So this is of course Omelette Gaming and then we have RGB lights. As you can see, let me turn the box around. We can see Pro Plus Dock charger so this product comes in two colors i believe white and black so i got the black one because my controllers are yellow i guess if i buy the white one yeah it wouldn't match that well so let's see the features multi-charge station and there's overcharge shield multi rgb modes and a seamless design so you can see it looks really really professional all right so what do you get so these are the features you can see there's also rgb mode button and all the other features right here package contents contains the dock itself and also the cable so in terms of power you have to have a charger that can output these amps and then you will get a very stable charge so you can see supported devices right here really really nice let's quickly just crack into the packaging all right so usual two box affair you have one on the outer one on the inner all right so the presentation is always spot on i would say so on the inside you can see it's really nicely padded a very nice foam so it's not going to get damaged in shipping because we have the dock itself very very sturdy very very solid you can see how it all comes together of course we have to check out what else comes in the box remove this foam right here so i guess the cable fell off so this is actually the USB-A to USB-C cable. So you can use any USB-A to USB-C cables lying around. It's the same thing. All right, so let's take a look around the dock. So you can see omelette branding right here. You can see all the grooves. And on the back, you get the USB-C charging port. Bottom, you get these sticky pads. Of course, I'm not going to take them off yet. You do have to clean your surface well. And then you'll get a very, very sturdy grip. You can see this button for the RGB lights. Overall, very nice and very sturdy construction. All right, guys. So now we got it all plugged in. You can see the RGB lights. See right here. This is now blue color. So you can actually press the button, I believe, to actually change the modes. Does it work? Let's put a hole on it. Just try to hold and see what happens. Yeah. So this is actually the light mode. You can see right here. Okay, so this is actually pretty good because you can see there are slots for four controllers. So every section has its own LED notification light to tell you when it's fully charged or when it's charging. So let me show you guys a demo. So we're going to slot these omelette controllers in. First one goes in. You can see right here. It actually changes to red to show that it's charging that particular section of the dock. Let's slide in the left one. And see it shows the left one is charging so it's really really nice let me just uh, grab my original switch controllers okay guys so i have my original switch controllers and i'm going to use this charger to charge it as well slot the right one in you can see shows that one more slot is in use and the last one right here right you can see it shows that all the four slots have been used Okay, so you can actually see when it's fully charged. You can see right here, it actually shows it's green. Greenish yellow, I would say. Let's plug this back in. Yeah, it shows that it's fully charged. Because these controllers are actually already fully charged. Alright, so if you guys are interested in this product, I'll leave the link in the description as usual. And of course, if you do have any questions, you can just hit me up in the comment section below. So this has been a pretty quick unboxing and test of the omelette pro plus dock so honestly i think this is a very good addition if you have multiple controllers around and do not want to keep switching the and do not want to keep switching out the controllers from your device itself of course you'll get worn eventually so you can use something like this to eliminate wear and tear all right so thanks guys for watching i'll catch you guys in the next video